it has not killed traditional marketing whatsoever. If anything, it's enhanced and supplemented what uh, a lot of companies, both small and large, do on the traditional front. The, the one thing that Internet has said as it relates to small businesses, it's totally leveled the playing field. So we represent some very large clients, and they are getting their lunch eaten on a regular basis mm -hmm. by much, much smaller businesses who now have the power to publish their own content, to disseminate that content via all sorts of digital channels, uh, to tap the power of the consumer and get the consumer to take their message and to talk about their products and to talk about their services and influence their family and friends. So, you know, as far as saying like the model's been turned upside down, it's been totally turned upside down. So there's still a role for traditional marketing, right? But the internet has allowed companies to a supplement that traditional marketing effort, which usually costs a lot of money, mm -hmm. a lot of dollars, a lot of commitment, which small businesses, of course, don't have, especially compared to larger competitors. Um, it's allowed them to supplement those efforts with very low cost, uh, low time commitment uh, activities that can have a huge impact on how people perceive your brand, how people interact with and use your products and services, but most importantly, and this is where it gets really exciting for us, is how people can take that message and communicate it out to their networks because they love your brand, they've had a good experience with your brand, they've mm -hmm. had a good experience with your product, and that's where the, the opportunity really lies.